Welcome to our new showcase about the brand new feature for Volumetric Fog and Mist for URP, called Scattering, introduced in version 10. This feature will make the fog in the scene more realistic by simulating the refraction of the light as it crosses the mist environment. In the built-in version of Volumetric Fog and Mist, you can find a similar option called Death Blur. If you're just starting to use Volumetric Fog and Mist for URP, make sure you have imported the latest Volumetric Fog and Mist version, and let's configure the URP asset. Head over to Project Settings, select or add a new URP asset, and in the Render Feature list add Volumetric Fog and Mist. Now you can create a volume, and the Fog Manager game object will be created. Here is where the scattering feature is located. You can see the fog effect without the scattering option on the left side and enable on the right. You can clearly see that the effect is much more realistic on the right and the environment becomes more immersive. In addition, you can also adjust values like brightness, which increases the intensity of the incoming light, and the brightness threshold, which limits the intensity multiplier to bright pixels in the screen. The absorption parameter controls the amount of energy that the fog will reduce from the outscattering light, creating a light decay effect. And finally, the tint color lets you add an artistic touch to the final composition by adding a custom color tint to the result. We hope you enjoyed this new feature of Volumetric Fog and Mist and can't wait to see what you can achieve. Thank you for watching this video and don't forget to check our social media and the description for more cool tools and assets.